Hello everyone, Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas, and yes, I have to repeat the same sweater as last time, sorry. Are you ready for today? <sighs> yes, I'm ready. Are you happy for today? Um, no. Yes, of course I'm happy. <laughs> yes, so yesterday we spent the Christmas Eve at my dad's partner's house and today we're gonna go to my aunt's house to be with my mom's family and it's gonna be fun and we're gonna eat a lot and yesterday I ate a lot because Christmas Eve is my day because there's no meat in Rome woo, 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 woo. hello everyone and today is Saint Stephen and I have antlers Today is my turn to rock the Christmas sweater that you already know and we're going to my uncle's house to have the third day of non-stop eating <laughs> Oh my god, I'm not even hungry This morning I was like, oh, I don't want to eat anymore I'm turning into Chris What's up, you two? Hey! Yo. Hello everyone Today is December 28th So just a few days ago it was Christmas Eve, Christmas and Saint Stephen If you don't know what Saint Stephen is It's like a third Christmas in Italy Where you just eat all day and spend the day with your family and friends And this year it was also Brian's, my American husband's second Christmas in Italy If you miss that Last year I made a video about his first Christmas in Italy and all the things that he expected, all these expectations and fears, everything. It was hilarious, I think. But this year, since it's the second one, I still want to ask him a few questions. Baby boy, can you come? Yes. My baby boy, thank you for being here. I have a few questions for you. Okay. So do you remember last year where I asked you a lot of questions about the Italian Christmas? Yes. And like you didn't know what to expect and the food and everything. Um, this year, did you feel the same level of what's it gonna happen or were you feeling more like, yeah, I know the Italian traditions? Definitely in the second one. I mean, it's pretty chill. Like the more you get used to it, the easier it gets, you know? Not that it was ever difficult, but... Yeah, like I was laid back. What are some things that you found easier to do or to be around this year compared to last year? Just the general situation of like sitting around and talking a lot is like easier. Instead. Yeah, I totally noticed that because in the Italian Christmas sometimes you sit there and you talk for hours and this year you handled it very, very well. Thank you. You know how it can be so hard to listen to a foreign language for so many hours and after a while you might start to turn off. But this year he participated the whole time. So I was like this, blah 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 blah. <laughs> yeah, we also played games this year more than last year. That's true. Games so, gives me something to talk about instantly. You made it a li little easier and it's also fun. And how about the food? Because I noticed something. The food was, it was good as always. But I noticed something in your attitude towards food. I purposely didn't eat that much. I noticed because last year you were not used to having like a appetizers. First main dish, a second main dish, and then all the desserts and then all the side dishes. But you were like, oh my god, you guys eat so much. And after the appetizers you were full. Mm -hmm. But this year he knew, he knew. So he was like, okay, this is just the appetizer. So <laughs> just got few things and then when it was like the first main dish he was like okay let me try not to get full you were That's overall true. able to eat more because you had your strategy yeah you look like et with this hoodie thank you <laughs> what a sweet compliment but yeah like this time around i knew like psh bimil this is just the beginning boy don't get full on this so i was like we were like brian you want more of this and i was like no Brian, what about this? You liked it, right? You want more? And I was like, yes, I liked it. Do I want more? Nope. And then what do you know? Then bring the next plate out, 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 bring the next plate out. And I knew that was gonna happen this time, so dab on them Also, you learn how to play one of the most traditional Italian Christmas games. Yeah, like it's difficult to learn how to play. You freaking listen to the number and you do this. Tombola. 
<laughs> it's the like bingo. Game of all time. It's an Italian bingo where you win a prize if you have two numbers in a row and three, four, five, and bingo. Very simple oh. game. Yeah, well, you liked it. Yeah. You even you were so lucky. You won a lot. Yeah, strategy. I'd say more endurance to group speaking, group chat. More endurance to food, Italian games. I'd say this year was different from last year. You were prepared, baby boy. Just imagine in 20 years. I chilled. Now it's my turn to try the American Christmas, which I tried once. Yeah, American. That was fun. Americans are fire, we bring the heat. Think about Brian's I family. I miss Christmas. When? When you're dead? No, like until next year. Oh, yeah, well once a year well we had a good christmas just wanted to give you guys an update and merry christmas late merry christmas merry christmas and happy new year da -da 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 -da. yo subscribe to brilla hey wait it's my channel shameless plug but why? This is not even the end of the, the vlog. We're just getting started. Subscribe to Brilla. And Tanya Candy, it's okay. They know. Okay, let's go.